for those in their 20s who are happy, who are sad, who are confused. For those in their 20s who are not quite sure how they are, this is for you. Your 20s are so confusing. I mean, I'm only three years in and I have literally never been so confused. And with the constant online comparison of what other 20-somethings are doing, and with the hundreds of different opinions about what you should or shouldn't be doing in your 20s, it makes it so difficult to work out what you actually want to do and at a pace that's right for you. I was always under the impression that people in their 20s had it all figured out. They were so grown up and so obviously they knew what they were doing. Growing up, I also thought that you have this idea in your head about where you'll be, what you'll be doing, how old you want to be when you get married, when you buy a house, if that's something that you want to do. But in reality, I have never felt so unsure about the next five years. I couldn't tell you my five-year plan, and not because I'm hiding it, but because I simply don't know. If we were told when we were growing up that your 20s are for having fun, you're figuring it out, for trying new things, and just living, I feel like we'd all have such a different perspective on how we're actually doing. But, I mean, when your parents get married in their early 20s, it's pretty difficult to grow up and not have that idea that that will be you too. The fact is that in this day and age, you can choose between going traveling or buying a house, which will get you either the response of, you are now stuck in a mortgage or you ruined your career by taking a break, usually from the non 20 something year olds. Tell me how you're supposed to have a five year plan when nothing you do is right. You're either too old or too young, too naive or too dumb <laughs> as an accent to rhyme maybe i should be in poetry it is easy to fall into the trap of everything wrong about your 20s the pressure the rights the wrongs the invisible timeline that you're not sticking to but there are plenty of things to love your 20s are the first time in your life when you're experiencing adulthood and you actually have the freedom and flexibility to do what you want. Be that to meet new friends, listen to new music, or pick up new hobbies. I love when people around me decide to try new things, whether that's starting a business, changing their career, or picking up a new hobby. These are the experimentation years at the end of the day. So can we all just decide, just have so much more fun. My boyfriend and I decided a few weeks ago that we wanted to start tennis again and the next week we had bought rackets and booked a court and we're now on the road to Wimbledon. Joking. But I do love the freedom and the spontaneity of being in your 20s and being able to do literally whatever you want. Although I do have to admit that I have to be in the right mindset to be spontaneous but that's a whole different topic. I am currently getting ready to go on my friend Meg's podcast and like I, I'm literally so so excited I can't wait so her podcast is all around literally everything to do with the 20s and it's just so good she brings on like special guests and she does like a whole 20 something and trying series up until now it's been more like influencers and like different niches and also like maybe she had like a finance expert on which is really really good and it's quite nice to hear from fellow 20 somethings you know what they're feeling like how they're dealing with stuff you know so you don't feel so alone so i'm also going to go ask her a couple questions and get her opinion on being in her 20s we've got jess on the podcast today hi Hello. hi <laughs> thanks for having me I'm so excited. okay you've got three hours in the morning how do you want to spend your time to film yeah i think is the ultimate goal level of happiness yeah. i aspire to have do you find it hard to live in the moment or just I do, but now it's on my lock screen. My motto for this year is live in the present, say yes more. I'm taking it now as being kind of like my selfish years. When I first started my nine to five, I did nothing. I, I, I woke up, I went to work, I came back, I was 
shut. <laughs> Thank you so Thanks so much. much. Have you guys enjoyed? Obviously, you have. <laughs> like, welcome to my <laughs> podcast. <laughs> so, obviously, in your series, you've chatted to a lot of different twenty-something-year-olds. Mm -hmm. So, what is the general consensus? How are fe people feeling in their twenties? Oh, so I will say most of the people I've spoke to are probably actually like twenty-five plus. Okay. Like I've spoke to a lot of people that are like 25, 26. and the funny thing is they're all like it's funny how much it looks like a couple of years difference can make like the early versus late 20s mm -hmm. because they are all very much like oh god i was so lost but now i'm still lost and i'm just kind of riding with it like a lot of them just say like you kind of just get used to that feeling of uncertainty and you kind of just like almost learn to like ride the wave because they've obviously got like proof now of like four years of being lost and yeah. like mm, it's all still working out then for you can you tell us mm -hmm. how you're feeling in your 20s oh my god <laughs> i feel like you've caught me a bad time <laughs> my vibe for 23 experimenting a bit more i wouldn't say i feel lost but i would say i feel bored mm -hmm. i'm definitely with like a bit of spice and I'm obviously in like a really lovely position where like I can go and like look for that elsewhere and it's not like I want to like jump jobs and like need the security so I want to try and make the most of that I think I'd actually love to spend it like experimenting and like learning more and like meeting more new people and like not not stopping the almost like childhood like curiosity because yeah. I feel like I kind of lost that from like uni burnout what advice would you give to other people in their 20s my advice for people always is just like trust trust in the universe there's yeah. never going to be a point where like you're so lost to like the point of no return yeah like yeah, yeah, yeah. it's going to work itself out it's going to be okay you've got some kind of path that like you're going to follow mm -hmm. and to trust that this is me showing you that as a fellow 20 something it's okay to be figuring it out and to be changing your mind this is what life is about and i think your 20s especially there's no right or wrong way to spend your 20s although it may feel like there is some of the time but whatever you're doing no matter what you are doing so well and you're making the fellow 20 somethings very very proud